there is already so much more in this DLC than, than Jaws of Khan. Yes. This is way better. So much better. I wish they had put so much more into Jaws of Hakan. Like, there was a lot of cool stuff in Jaws of Hakan, but it wasn't, like, given to you. You kind of had to read it, it and shit. The blight. It's spreading. Yes. It's gonna hurt. Just remember, you're already dead. Drink some ale. It will help. Wish the bastard had run me through. All right. Use the ancient lift, but let's talk to people. <clears throat> What's up, dude? I to ask, Inquisitor. Sky hold, how does it... Well, hold in the sky. <laughs> oh, the old fall into the sky routine. How do you keep it from floating away? It's built into a mountain. Uh, held by the stone, then. He thinks that it'll just float away. Yeah, I think Beric was talking about that. Had they, or that's I, just a common myth. Had they the, think they'll fall up? Yeah. Yeah. Shaper Volta said you're a veteran of the Blight. That was a wet-nosed recruit. But you survived. Swing your axe long enough, you're bound to hit something. You must have racked up a few stories. <laughs> Maybe when this is all over. I'll have the time and ale to tell them. Most of Ren's stories end with decapitation. I'm an efficient guy. I'd like to know more about the Legion of the Dead. The Legion's pretty straightforward. We keep the Darkspawn out of Orzabar, and we're sodding good at it. Becoming a Legionnaire is a lifelong oath, one that can't be broken. We celebrate our own funerals before coming to the Deep Roads. As far as our families and Orzammar are concerned, we're already dead. Hence the name. That's quite the commitment. Well, it isn't a glamorous life. Every Legionnaire has their own reasons for joining. From the common criminal to the Deep Lord with illusions of grandeur. All are accepted. What about you? Why did you join? I had a responsibility. A historian and a soldier. That's an unlikely friendship. <laughs> what makes you think we're friends? The bickering. <laughs> Fair enough. Vault has got the stones of a silent sister. Doesn't mean I won't give her a hard time. Thanks for your time. All right, let's get out of here, man. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Oh my god. Everybody, please. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, you guys can... Look at all the things with the stuff. Alright. Normally we might... Well, no. Normally we might read that, but we're both really, really sick. So, no, we won't. Get out of here, man. She's like, I regret this. I regret this instantly. I'm an elf, I'm supposed to be running around on fields and shit. I don't like this. Oh man, just this down into blackness. This would freak me out yeah. really bad. I would freak out. Do you remember the movie, The Descent? Nope. <laughs> no, because I was like on drugs when I saw it. So I don't know what it's about, but it scared the fuck out of me. Don't do drugs. <laughs> <clears throat> don't do drugs, kids. Ooh, this what is. Was that? What was what? Something moved. There. Light a torch. So I can oh. See it's coming. Just stay close. I can't light a torch. I guess we just gotta. Here, I'll use my magical elf glowiness. I guess. If Fenris would here, was here, we wouldn't have a problem. I know. Fenris, glow! And you'd be like, oh my god. God, guys. 
Oh, there's something glowing off in the distance moving around. Ooh, I wonder we are if it's practically blind down here. We've gone past the deep roads. How can you tell? It's pitch black. I can feel it. Delirium's alive. Ooh, I wonder if we're gonna run into those rock creatures from Dragon Age 2. Oh, I'm glad we brought Varric, because he will know what those are. Who's the yes. only one who's seen those before? Uh-oh. Oh, boy. So do you think the rocks are looking at us, or...? Jump. Oh. Wonderful. Now, there's things... They're moving around, so... Maybe they live inside the lyrium. Oh wait, no, here yeah, we go. Yeah, see they're moving. Show yourselves. Oh, uh oh shit, are you okay? I'm sure you're fine, right? Ren! <laughs> Your armor got it though, right? You're fine? <laughs> Whoa! Not at all. No! Oh wait, no, you're dead? Or what? Oh, Whoa. Just dudes with guns. What are these things? Rude. Shaw brittle bolter? I wonder what they are. Oh my god, is this like a new race of people? That's cool, right? Yes! Are they taller than the dwarves or are they just other dwarves? Eh. Maybe they're like, I don't, they can see in the darkness, so clearly they've been down here a while. Maybe they're a different type of, maybe they're a less evolved version of dwarves, because dwarves clearly come from Lyrium. And they're like more in touch with being Lyrium. Right? No? I was just thinking that maybe at some point the two factions split off and some of them came all the way down here and have evolved differently so they would be able to see in the dark and stuff. I would think that some of them stayed down here, stayed all Lyrium y, and some went further up. Whoa. Boyfriend's dead, I'm sorry. That's what he signed up for, though. You deserved better. Ren never wanted this life. He was a cobbler, a good one. He joined the Legion to pay his father's debts. It kept his mother and brother from losing their caste. The poor and desperate here often sacrifice themselves for their family's future. Just gonna say the cast system kind of blows. Uh, sorry for your loss. Yes. Saying he knew the risk is kind of douchey. Yeah. Ren was a good man. We'll honor his sacrifice. He always seemed indestructible. The armor on these warriors. There's lyrium woven directly into the metal, and it's bonded to their skin. Ha! Impossible to remove, but I know what we'd find underneath. These are dwarves. Ren was killed by our own kind. Well, I mean, that's kind of a stretch. Clearly, you haven't known that uh, it was existed for what, like, thousands of years? Yeah. They're not from Orzoar! <laughs> Their weapons are powerful. Those other two's responses make you sound like an idiot. Yeah. So. All it took was a single strike. Ren never had a chance. The bolt was glowing. Their weapons could also have been infused with lyrium. I won't leave Ren like this. We must return him to the stone. Thrust on Shah, Saroka. 
Where are we going to carry his body or are you going to turn him into a rock? I'll see this through, Ren. I promise. Mari, what did she say? I have not learned Dwarvish, but I'll translate it later. Anything standing between not us and the Dwarvish. Titans will regret it. Hey, man. I will translate that, that later to my best ability. Alright, I guess we just go into the darkness. Oh look! Lyrium roots! Yes! Cool. This is cool. I mean, it's kind of bullshit that we're just coming down here and we're like, hey, I know this is where you guys live, but we're gonna just walk down here and start killing all of you. Well, they started it. I mean, come on. Although it is a miscommunication. We didn't even try to go like, hey! 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 I'm just saying, we kind of like blustered down here and we're like, Yo, so I heard there's like a titan down here. It's like causing earthquakes up top. So we're just going to go snuff that out real quick. Uh, you guys are kind of in our way, so we're going to kill you. We're not going to even try and say hi or anything. Not even gonna try and say some ancient, like, Dorvis or anything. That would be rude. Let's just get out of here. Anything good? Nah, no, just money. <laughs> Follow Valto through the... Oh, what the dinosaurs! Yay! <laughs> How do we even know what that's called? Dinosaurs! To gear. Hold on, guys. I'm getting a gear right now, okay? Oh, is there one on the other side? Nope. nope. Okay. Oh, I forgot to look around. Wow! Rocks! Yay, rocks! <laughs> Illyrium. Wow. Whoa, what's this about? It's like a map. This is like the wall of memories in Orzammar, but ancient. Very ancient. The words Touch it. are based in Dwarven, but I barely recognize this dialect. Can you translate any of it? Only fragments. The language is very different from what we speak today. This word keeps appearing. Shah Bratal. I believe it means revered defenders. Do they defend the Titans? <laughs> we're really looking forward to seeing a Titan. If we don't see one, we're going to get pissed. What needs to be protected all the way down here? e Satanal. e Satanal. Cut our tongues. Entomb our bodies. Watch over the Titan until it stirs. So the warriors who attacked us must be the Shabratal, and they're protecting a titan. Are you all right, Volta? I can hear Ren's objections. Let's keep moving. If more of these memories exist, they may have the answers we need. It was coming on so hard. 
Ow. It hurts. <laughs> Stacy, you see your future in my pain. No! Oh, wait. Collect. From gear. where? Collect. You oh. Get the gear. I will. It's down there, though. I wonder if they included extras, if they just scattered a bunch throughout the place, or if you're gonna have to go back and, like, find every- s Oh, there's another one. To the left. I know. I just- Not feeling so good. Where is it? Oh. Yeah. It's there. So, they said that- she said that the material for the gears, they said it looked like our design, but we didn't put it here. So maybe it's these ancient dwarves. Yeah, I'm pretty sure what I'm uh, uh, make, assuming is that the, these dwarves are probably the dwarves that like, you know, stuck to the old ways and didn't go further up. And, and like, those dwarves are like, what are you? Closer to the surface a little bit, dwarves? Yeah. There's always a new way to just be like a dick. Mm -hmm. Good thing those bombs are going off. Get out of here, man. Oh, shit. I wonder if dwarves were originally, like, watchers of the titans. Like, if they originally existed together down here. And then when, um, when the other ones branched off and moved farther up, they erased all memories of the titans and of the old dwarves. Maybe the titans made the dwarves. There's something strange on the other side. I can feel it. My guess is another earthquake that hits when we're halfway across the bridge. Watch because your step. Because the thing is that Solus says that dwarves are made of an ancient titan, long since dead. Mm -hmm. The arm of it sabotaged the bridge, and we don't have time to fix it. There, that ledge. We can reach it if we're careful. What? What are we what talking ledge? about? What? That? Are you... Girl, are you serious? So Sola says, ah, dwarves, you're like a, you're like the arm of like an ancient dead titans, whatever. It's, it's like asleep, but no longer conscious and will never come back, blah, blah, blah. Mm hmm So I assume that Solas knows something. Solas knows a lot of things. How do you know that? Uh, a dream? Uh, spirits. Dreams. Spirits. 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 Spirit of, told uh, me. of the arm told me in a dream. Look there. More ancient carvings. Aye. But these seem to be about the Titan. It shapes the stone. It is the stone. There we go. It sculpts the world within and without. Cool. Wouldn't something that can sculpt the world have to be rather... enormous? It is called a titan. They were <laughs> called the Pillars of the World. So... Someone else thought that it was Andruel who killed all of them. So it's a shaper of the stone. Like you. This implies that the titans are actually sculptors. And our world is their clay. Oh shit. Wow. Does that mean that they're the forgotten ones? If Titans shaped the stone, could they have actually created it? The stone must have existed first. Then the Titans would be the very first children of the stone. That would have huge implications for my people. I don't see how you didn't figure this out before. It seemed pretty obvious to everybody else. Everybody, meaning me and Stacy, or just myself. <laughs> 
No, to Just like, Mari. to like, I mean, if Solus is walking around being like, oh, hey, guess what? You're, you're, uh, your extensions of a dead god, you know. Just in case you were wondering. Like. More memories, more sharp retold. We must be getting close to a titan. Your theory about the source of the quakes is looking more like fact. But if this is true, how could it be missing from the memories of Orzammar? Why would someone erase such an integral part of our history? Remember that one episode of Doctor Who where they were riding a space whale and they Let's kept yeah. missing the queen for after we stopped the earthquakes. The rhythm is louder than ever. We're close. This is gonna be like the episode of Doctor Who, you know? Yes, with the space whale. Yeah, and the where they're like riding the space whale and they keep hurting it, but like they don't know what is happening because nobody knows that they're riding a space whale. Yeah, so and then the queen intentionally forgets about the space whale because she feels so bad about the space whale. Yeah, because they're hurting it to get it to like carry them places. If this ends up being the exact plot of the Doctor Who space whale, this is gonna be hilarious. <laughs> Whoa. Oh boy. The most popular dwarf in the Merchant's Guild. Wow. All these lyrium veins, and they're completely mine. <laughs> the Shabratol must mine lyrium somewhere. Their weapons and armor are laced with it. Wow. Unless they found another way to harness it. Unless they are it. Whoa! This ends up being the plot of the space whale thing. It's gonna be so great. Guys, I just finished watching Doctor Who. I have an idea for the next DLC. <laughs> hey, this is a really nice place you got here. I just claimed it and now I'm gonna kill you. It's very, uh, English settlement. Yeah. Mine. I'm kind of feeling like an asshole right now. How do we even know what they're called before we even like talk to them? Well, we knew what they we knew what they were called before we even saw those memories. Uh huh. But. At this point, we know what they're called because we've read that first memory and it called them the Shavratal Defenders. I'm just gonna pretend they were an elf and so that we're like magical and you know. You know how it is being an elf, knowing everything all the time. Yeah. climb it. No, 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 no. Impossible. There's no way to get around it. Don't be foolish, Stacy. Place the thing in the gate. What thing? The thing that you just picked up. Oh, I thought that was... Alright. That is the easiest thing ever. You're welcome. I thought there was gonna be a whole quest. This is why you brought me here. Yeah. to travel this far. Well, other than the people who are already here, yeah. I mean, come on, guys. I, that's, that's so... <laughs> uh. You guys are being a little bit uh, not aware of yourselves. Yeah. It, we're the first people down here, except for the people that already... Oh, oh shit. <laughs> 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 that was great. <laughs> no, these people that already live here, they don't count. No, no, no. They're, no, who, no, no, no. Nobody no. knows about them, except for them. Whoa. Whoa. You guys where are, are... Where are they? They're down there. Uh-oh. I hope I didn't need his skull. For opening a door of any kind. Oh! 
Mine! Don't know why it's mine, but it's mine! Uh, I guess I can't get his weapon. Oh, maybe I- oh, okay. Cool. Yes, that's what we need. Okay. Wow! Alright, well, if we don't get to a story <coughs> part soon, I'm out of here because I'm not feeling it. Are you feeling it? What do you mean? Feeling the sickness? Feeling the sickness? Are you down with the sickness? Am I... Can I get up, get down with the sickness? Am I just feeling ill? Yeah. And want to take a break? Yeah. I'm so torn because, like, this is so awesome and I want to see, like, what happens. But you're also extremely sick. Yeah. Well, luckily these Earthshaker battles don't seem to be as, like, ultra epic as that Darkspawn mess. Holy fuck, that, like, wrecked me, right? <laughs> so, where did it go? 